Summer is right around the corner, so it's time to gear up for some serious lawn care. But with so many options available, it can be tough to choose the right zero-turn mower. That's why we've put together this list of the top three residential zero-turn mowers that are new in 2023. Make sure to stick around until the end of this video because I'll be sharing a special offer that you're not going to want to miss out on for your next outdoor equipment purchase. Also stick around because I'll show you how all of the mowers in this video stack up side by side so you can decide for yourself which one is best. If you want to learn more about any of the mowers on this list, check the links in the description down below. Now subscribe to the Tractor Bob YouTube channel and let's get started. I'm super excited to get this mower in the shop and do some filming of it, and it made it on this list because it's brand new to 2023. It's the Husqvarna Excite Z380 and Z350 zero-turn mowers. These new zero-turn mowers from Husqvarna have several really cool features that we haven't seen before. Both mowers are considered residential grade, but they can also be used for small business landscapers. Both mowers are pretty much identical with a few upgrades on the engine and transmission for the Z380. The mowing deck is fabric fabricated and made of 10 gauge solid steel. The mower has a steel reinforced leading edge and comes in a 54 inch cut. There are a total of four anti-scalp wheels. The deck has three blades and a plastic chute. The deck adjustment style is a really nice dial and foot pedal solution that I haven't seen before. And the cut height variability ranges from 1.5 to 4.5 inches. For the powertrain, the engine that you get is a Kohler Pro 7000. That's 747 cc and 26 horsepower, which is a gas engine and the fuel tank capacity is only 4.3 gallons. The top speed is an impressive 9 miles per hour. The transaxles that come on the Husqvarna Excite mowers are the TZ350s by Tough Torque for the Husqvarna Excite Z350, which are high-end residential grade transaxles. You can also get the HTE10 transaxles by Parker on the Husqvarna Excite Z380, which are commercial grade transaxles. Finally, the back tires are 22 by 10 by 10 and are re tread while the front caster tires are 13 by 6.5 by 6. The features that come on the new Excite mowers by Husqvarna is really what makes this mower stand out. For starters, it comes with a nice cup holder and rear accessory rack for transporting small to medium sized objects, which seems neat. The front and rear tie down spots make this mower easy to load onto a trailer. The battery is also in an easy to locate position by removing the plate under the seat. The fact that it comes with a front mounted LED bar is a nice touch. We still haven't talked though about the two biggest features that come on this mower. First is the smart control system, which allows you to start and stop the engine and engage and disengage the mowing blades right from the control arms. This means you'll have more control at your fingertips. The last major feature is the smooth ride suspension system, which features Husqvarna's new best in class suspension with adjustable springs and 10 comfort settings. So you can dial in the perfect ride. Also the four bar link system creates a smoother ride with no rocking or wobbling. Now for the price of the Husqvarna Excite mowers. For starters, you can find the residential version of this mower, the Excite Z350, for just $5,499, which is a rock solid deal for a mower with such great features. Now, if you're needing a more commercial oriented option, the Z380 will be priced at about $6,999. Now, it's important to note that all the prices in this video are subject to change, so contact your local dealer to get the exact pricing for the mower you're looking for. Last year, Toro released the Titan Max to consumers as their biggest and best residential zero-turn mower. This year, Titan has taken it one step further by releasing a limited edition version of the Titan Max, also known as the Titan Max Havoc Edition. This machine has all the same great features as the regular Titan Max with several interesting upgrades. But before we go over what those upgrades are, let's take a look at the specs. The mowing system is Toro's iron-forged fabricated deck, made from 10-gauge steel with a bull nose lead cutting edge. The mower comes with a 60 inch cut and there are three anti-scalp wheels. The deck has three blades and a very nice heavy duty rubber chute. The deck adjustment style is the pin plus foot pedal system and the cut height variability ranges from 1.5 to 5 inches. The pin style deck adjustment isn't my favorite type of adjustment system for a mower, but at least it gets the job done. For the powertrain, the engine that you get is the Kohler Pro 747cc 26 horsepower, which is a gas engine with a fuel 
tank capacity of 7 gallons and a top speed of 9 miles per hour. The transaxles that come on the Toro Titan Max are the Hydro Gear ZT 2800s, which are rated to be top end residential grade transaxles. Finally, the back tires are 23 by 12 by 12 with Reaper tread, and the front tires are 13 by 6.5 by 6. The Titan Max also features a nice cup holder and small storage compartment directly behind the cup holder. The mower has a step through front end as well as a step on deck, so you'll have plenty of ways to get on and off this mower. Next, the Titan Max features an easy flip up floorboard, so access to your belts and spindles is simple. The floorboard has a rubber mat for added grip and shock absorption. The battery is in an easy to access position located on the left hand side of the engine. The Toro Titan Max Havoc Edition has several important upgrades that make it a cut above the regular Titan Max. For starters, you go from 2800 transaxles to 3100 transaxles, meaning the limited Havoc Edition has commercial quality transaxles. Next, you get a blacked out body and frame and a blacked out mowing deck, which I personally like the look of. You also get a ROPS mounted light bar, which might come in handy, plus a 23 inch high back seat for added comfort. And finally, the Havoc Havoc Edition comes with custom two-toned aluminum alloy wheels, which look dope, don't you think? Oh so my god, dope. so dope. Dope, that looks dope, dope, yeah, dope, yeah. That looks so, so dope. dope. Now for the price of the Toro Titan Max, which retails for $7,099. Now, if you're wanting the Titan Max Havoc Edition, then you'll be paying $7,699. Quite a bit more expensive, however worth it when you consider the upgrades plus the fact that you're getting a limited edition mower. All in all, the Titan Max Havoc Edition seems like a pretty cool mower. Let me know what you think about it in the comments down below. Believe it or not, we have another limited edition zero turn mower on this list and it just hit the market in 2023. Now it's called the ZT Elite Limited Edition. The regular ZT Elite has many of the same features as the ZT Elite Limited Edition. It's just that the limited edition has a few key upgrades that make it a cut above the regular ZT Elite. The Bad Boy ZT Elite features a fabricated, all welded, fully reinforced cutting deck that is made from seven gauge solid steel with a re reinforced leading edge. You can get the regular ZT Elite in a 48 inch, 54 inch or 60 inch cut and the limited edition only comes in a 60 inch cutting option. The 60 inch cutting deck comes with six anti-scalp wheels. The deck takes three blades and the mower has a nice heavy duty rubber chute. The cut height variability is 1.5 to 4.5 inches and the deck is adjusted using a deck dial and foot pedal system which is a really nice feature to have. For the powertrain you have several engine options for the regular ZT Elite which we won't get to in this video. However they are all high end residential engine options. On the ZT Elite Limited Edition, you get two engine options, which are upgraded entry-level commercial quality engines. First is the Kohler Confidant ZT740, that's 747cc and 25 horsepower. And the next is the Briggs CX127, that's 810cc and 27 horsepower. The engines are gas and the ZT Elite comes with a fuel tank capacity of 6.5 gallons and a top speed of seven miles per hour. Both the ZT Elite and ZT Elite Limited Edition feature the commercial quality Hydro Gear ZT3100 transaxles. Finally, the back tires are 22 by 11 by 10 Reaper tread on the ZT Elite Limited Edition, and the front tires are 13 by 6 by 6. The Bad Boy ZT Elite and ZT Elite Limited come with a nice cup holder and generously sized storage compartments on both sides of the mower. The mower has a step on deck, so getting on and off the mower will be easy. The ZT Elite features a easy flip up floorboard and seat and has easy access to the spindles, belts, battery, and other components. The floorboard comes with a sweet Reaper Tread rubber floor mat for added grip and shock absorption. You also get Bad Boy's patented independent front suspension, which is awesome. The ZT Elite Limited Edition has several key upgrades. For starters, the Limited Edition has the engine upgrades, which we already touched on. Next, the Limited Edition has a blacked out paint job on the entire body, the frame, and the entire mowing deck. Bad Boy has also added some other aesthetic upgrades as well, like laser cut arm grips, which are really cool, and a CNC cut limited edition logo on the title plate. 
you also get a really nice receiver hitch that's mounted onto the back my favorite upgrade that you get on this limited edition zero turn mower is the seat the limited edition seat has really cool styling and bad boy's signature aggressive and tough aesthetic but more importantly the seat actually comes on a rubber suspension platform so you'll sit slightly higher up and have a noticeably smoother ride than on the regular zt elite now what about the price for the zt elite and zt elite limited edition well the cash price for the zt elite can range from five thousand one hundred and ninety nine dollars to six thousand forty nine dollars depending on the engine and cut size you choose for the zt elite limited edition the cash price is five thousand nine hundred and ninety nine dollars as far as financing goes you'll pay as low as one hundred and three dollars per month with approved credit keep in mind that this is the finance price that bad boy advertises on their website but make sure to contact your local dealer to find out about other financing options they might have all right, so now that we've covered some of the best new residential zero turn mowers for 2023, here's a breakdown of how the specifications match up side by side with each mower. And here's a breakdown of how the features match up side by side with each mower. Feel free to pause the video and look over how the mowers stack up against each other. Okay, as promised, I'm going to share with you a special offer that we have going on right now at Tractor Bob's. For a limited time only, we will be offering a free lifetime powertrain warranty on all new lawnmowers, tractors, and utility vehicles over 20 horsepower. Also, Tractor Bob is having a special open house event March 10th through the 11th where you'll be able to save thousands on your new equipment purchase. Purchase. Plus, we will be giving away tons of cool prizes, attachments, and accessories for your new lawn mower. So check the links in the description down below to our event page where you can RSVP and receive a bonus coupon at the door. Thank you so much for watching this video on the best new residential zero turn mowers in 2023. If you enjoyed this video, give us a big thumbs up. That really helps us out a lot. Hit that subscribe button to see more content like this and tap the bell icon to stay notified. Have a great day.